But you're the coolest guy. I, I love you. Just do. You, you, I saw you like you take the subway all the time. I know you like. I love the you, subway. I know, but you're Sophia Bush. I mean, you can't go on the subway. People notice. I, people are generally very cool. That's what I love about New York. People kind of are like, hey, and you're like, hey. Yo, bro, no, the, they're the kind of like that. But no, the only moment it was a little something is on Saturday. One of my best friends got married, and it was a wedding during the day. So my girlfriends and I are abnormally dressed up in the morning going into the city to go to Amanda's wedding and there was one guy who was very sweet he was like do you want me to take a picture of you guys and we were like sure and then he handed me back my camera and he goes are you Sophia Bush and I was like <laughs> yeah. you are a nice person that you were very chill oh really about how did they know that it was you sticking out on the subway when Listen, that's man. when that that's what you see no one dresses that gorgeous on the subway I, mean, I don't ever I don't even know walking down it's like the red carpet like it's totally it was like, yeah. But it was for a wedding. It was totally fashion This is not walking. my normal outfit. This is not <laughs> my normal outfit either. Oh, please. It's just for you. But then your friend, your friend started, she took, saw a guy reading a book. Okay, New Yorkers, do you understand? This has been a very interesting thing. My, my best friend and I are book nerds and both deeply single for so long that every day this week we've been like, why are there so many hot guys on the subway reading? And every day, every day for the last week, the books have gotten better. And yesterday, literally, I'm looking at this guy who's like so beautiful and he's reading Zadie Smith. And I'm like, are you my husband? <laughs> like, it's, like the, it's like the grown up version of, are you my mother? You're just like, what? <laughs> are is you it you? My husband? Is it you? <laughs> Who is it? An adult and, children's book. And yeah. then somebody tells me there's literally an Instagram account called Hot Guys Reading that is mostly pictures of hot guys on the subway reading. And I was like, well, where have I been my whole life? I don't uh, yeah, know. Yeah, I'd never heard of this thing. Yeah, I didn't know. Hot dudes reading. It's a thing. It's got like a million followers on Instagram. It's, yeah. I didn't know either. Well, I read all the time. I thought it was and, up uh, on the millennial yeah. thing. Cool. We'll make sure you get on it. Yeah, I got to try for we'll a long like time. We'll just like slide into York. their yeah. DMs with pictures yeah, of you. You have to slide it in. You can offer it right up. Yeah, okay. see if they'll take it. Well, yeah, if anyone I read from all the Hot time. Guys Reading is here, you should stage a shoot with Jimmy on the L train. It'll Thank be you. Yeah, it'll be yeah. perfect. Uh, I'll be your publicist. All right, you didn't grow up in New York, though, right? You... I didn't. So my mom grew up on the East Coast. I grew up coming here, but I grew up in California. Ooh. Yeah. So are you a, a, an outdoorsy person? Yes. Like an out, really, did you, I said this is not my normal outfit. I'm usually like... Camping, road tripping, just oh, out in nature. I've never been camping. I, th I think I went camping what? once. I've never ever. <laughs> my parents are from Brooklyn. And I, I barely were allowed in my backyard. I mean, really, this is frightening, frightening. I mean, you, you know, have to that go raccoon, camping. that raccoon climbed up a skyscraper. I mean, there's no rules. If there's no rules outdoors. <laughs> I don't trust animals. But if a raccoon can climb a skyscraper, what's he doing? What's you wrong can with go you? Camping. Get off the, the building, raccoon! Hey, what's he gonna do with me? He's if I'm just in a little tent. He's reclaiming his time. You reclaiming could do the his same. time. Oh my goodness, it was you know, frightening to me. He's don't like, you built this thing where my tree used to be. You need, you need to go camping. Did you ever? Were you ever attacked by an animal? I have not been attacked by an animal. I, I grew up going to summer camp uh, in Northern California, and I did. <laughs> Oh, hi. We invited yeah. your, your, Up in the Sierras. your camp. Yeah, brought, you invited brought, the whole camp I brought everyone here. From, from Gold Arrow <laughs> Camp. Uh, no, I, I had a, we had a little bit of an incident with a bear, but that's usually human error because people oh, sneak Human food error? Oh, my you, gosh. You see, yeah, the error is you shouldn't be outdoors camping. That's your first mistake. Nothing happened. Oh, my gosh. But it was, it was a good reminder to campers to not sneak food back into their tents and or cabins, which, like, duh. It's your own fault. Yeah. Uh, and did you see the bear? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Was he and reading a book? He wasn't. <laughs> hot Bears, hot bears reading. reading. I'm so amazing. here for that Instagram. It is his biggest Instagram uh, ever. That actually would be I the would... biggest account on Instagram. You're welcome. I wish I went to camp. I'd love to go to camp. It was I... so great. And, and do you what... do any outdoorsy things? No. Okay. I mean, no, if I, I, I do. I can give you a... a whole tip sheet. You really can? Oh, yeah. The biggest adventure I've been on recently, I took a group of my best girlfriends, because there's this weird thing where people think that girls are not outdoorsy, and I was like, oh, really, challenge accepted, watch me. And uh, I took all my girlfriends to Alaska, and we spent a week uh, fly fishing, and we were taking helis out up rivers. Helis out on rivers? Yeah, 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 look, yeah, look at, at you. This yeah. is the coolest thing ever, are you kidding me? This was very cool. We caught our dinner. It was great. See, this is insane to me. Yeah. You really did? Yes. Which you caught a salmon? I literally ordered a fish fillet, but I caught it myself. <laughs> Which you caught that salmon yeah. and then you like you and then we ate filleted it. it and Yeah. Wow. I got a I am gonna teach you a thing or two. It's I gonna a, be great. I have two little girls and I, I I have to raise them to be not me. You I know? Will take and them uh, camping. That's, 
That's I will take the... them camping. Please. I will be their camp counselor. Yes, that's perfect. Yes. Deal. That's perfect. Okay. Uh, we'll Sophia. have an Airstream caravan. Yeah, we'll do it. Okay. I would I'd love to do it. Make yeah. our own uh, fillet of fish. I, I literally play a badass girl superhero, so I can raise them with you. Not exactly with. I can be. I can you want to like move in with me? You can. Yeah, sure. Yeah, of course. I don't know raise about my that. girls. It's like a weird proposition. I'll ask my wife. She'll be totally good. She'll be totally fine with that. I will like to help teach them superhero things. Can Can we just talk about this? You're in a Pixar movie. I know. You're in a great Pixar movie. I know. Incredibles too. It's the best. I love Incredibles. Yeah, People it's, are so freaked out and excited about it. It's movie. my favorite Pixar movie ever. It's a fantastic movie. Ever. Holly Hunter, genius. She's amazing. Yeah. And I get to literally be her biggest fan, which is very appropriate uh, in the film. How and did life. you get cast in the. Uh, I don't know, which is the weirdest <laughs> thing because that doesn't happen. People are always like, oh, you know, you must be fielding all these offers. It's like you try to make smart choices, but come on. It's like, it's a job. Everybody's yeah. hustling. And I literally was sitting at lunch at a, a restaurant one of my best girlfriends opened, also Instagram, Alex T. Cooks. She's a badass. She'll teach you things. Um, just before you're ready for the wild, she can, like, teach you how to cook stuff. Anyway, <laughs> side note, tangential, not the point. I'm sitting at Alex's restaurant, and I get a text message telling me to open my email because people know that I don't do that. I hate email. I think it is, it's like the bane of my existence. So you read your text, you don't read your email. I read my text, and I read the news all day, and that's about it. Wow. So... I open my email and there's a PDF in it and I open it and um, they're asking me to come in and do Incredibles 2 and play Void and she's basically an engineer which like hello women in STEM love you and I freak out and I scream so loud that basically this many people turn and stare at me <laughs> and I was so embarrassed. But it happens. No, that's the moment. So you and should enjoy here. the moment. You yeah. should enjoy getting these things. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you're in Incredibles too. But I learned it's not a good thing to scream really loud when you're sitting right outside the kitchen of a restaurant. No, Because people course. assume there's a rat. <laughs> yeah, of course, And I was yeah. like, that's not it. No, it's good not, news. It's just actually good news. It's really good and news, and I can't tell you what it is. Void. Void. Void is because the name she, of your character. She opens voids. She manipulates space. She's a, she's a little nerd. And, uh, and she loves uh, Holly Hunter's character. Loves her. Obsessed with it. Loves her. Oh, man, I'm so happy for you. I cannot yeah. wait to see this. Uh, it's I want to so show everyone a clip. Here's the voice of Sophia Bush in Incredibles 2. Take a look. I never. Wow. Ah. Wow. Elastigirl. There you are. Hello. I. I didn't. Wow. Come on, get yourself together, Karen. Hi. My superhero name is Boyd. I just want to thank you for, like, for being you. And I just, oh, I just, like, uh, okay. What I can do um, is this. <laughs> yeah, that is impressive. Very interdimensional. I felt like an outcast before, but now with you being you, I feel like, <sighs> yay me. <laughs> Yay me! Yay me! That sounded like my interview with John Travolta. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. Uh, do you, are there dolls or is there an, there's action, an figure? action figure? I should have brought you one to stick in a dinosaur's mouth, but I didn't no. know. You have an action figure. I do. Dude, congratulations, Isn't it cool? Kyle. I'm so happy and for she you. So see you, Bush, everybody. Uh, uh -huh. On and on and on. Uh, I said. And it's on and on and on.